Good morning. I'm trying to let him dress. Hello everyone, welcome back to the vlogs. It is Thursday. I am running so late. I am finally doing my dress shopping today, um, or dress try-ons at least. Wanted to quickly show you guys my outfit before I run out. Uh, glasses are Dior. T-shirt is Aritzia. Skirt is Old Free People. Leather jacket is Sandro. Chanel 19 bag. I have my heels in here. I'm wearing my Spanx. I can't breathe. Let's go. snacking in her Saqqara life. Lily's code will be right here. If she wants to. Lily M, 20% off. Hello, I forgot I was vlogging today, but Lily and I finished shooting and we are heading to the bridal salon now. So I will have more about the dress shopping experience when we get there. For another boutique, oh, so we have a contender, which I think is the one. Hello, it is Friday. I'm home with Wade. Marco's out today playing golf. Um, I am just home today. Oh, that's a bug bite. So yesterday I went dress shopping, uh, moving along pretty well with the wedding planning stuff. And I also showed you guys my planner yesterday on Instagram stories. I will have her link down below as well. It was such a fun experience yesterday and I, to be honest, I was pretty nervous about the whole wedding dress shopping because obviously like pandemic weight gain, I'm pretty sure I went up like 15 pounds. I've taken some of it off. I'm still working on it. I'm not where I want to be, but I am feeling much better. Hold on, we dropped this toy but I am definitely feeling much better compared to where I was like maybe a few months ago before I started to use the Peloton a little bit more. I started to like walk around the city a little bit more. So yeah, I had a really good time. I kind of knew what I wanted going into it. There was a dress I had already been eyeing, so I was able to try it on and it did end up being the one, which is really exciting, but obviously I had to try on other dresses just to see, but then I always compared it to that one dress, Wade. <laughs> so yeah, I tried on a couple of different dresses uh, just to see, you know, different styles. Maybe something else would click for me, but I did end up going with the one that I wanted. And my wedding planner, Paulina, always says like, you are such a decisive person, which helps the wedding planning process. But I'm just so excited for everything to come together and I was definitely like very overwhelmed like the past few weeks with a lot of things, but I am glad that the wedding planning process isn't a part of it. It's actually been so nice. The only thing is I wish my mom was there for my um, dress try-ons, 
but I did show her the photo of the one that I wanted and she loves it which makes me really happy and so hopefully like I can bring her when I do like my official fittings and all that stuff but it felt so nice being able to show her going into the dress shopping I did wear Spanx bring pasties if you want if you're trying on things that might be a little bit more sheer up top Obviously, like you can edit dresses to have like liners and things like that. It was just a really fun experience. And I was there with my planner, Marco's two cousins and Lily. So in case anyone else is also dress shopping, what I brought with me were heels, my Spanx, and that was it. Uh, I definitely didn't need my heels because I stood on a podium and I think it's more important for the actual fitting just so that you can get the length right. And uh, pasties I didn't really need because I wasn't really trying on much sheer things. But at the one boutique where there were some sheer pieces, I was given like covers. So that was fine. But just something to keep in mind if you are going to try on some things that a little bit more showy. Um, obviously for picking out my dress, things I had to keep in mind were the fact that we're getting married in a church. So obviously I didn't want to be in anything that was a little bit too showy. Um, so that was one thing I kept in mind. Also the fact that we're having a destination wedding. I kept in mind the size of the dress and the weight of it because I wanted to make sure I could easily travel with it and also that I could carry it with me throughout the day. Like it wouldn't weigh me down so much and I could easily move in it and I could also eat and sit and dance comfortably in it. So yeah, that I think was pretty much it in terms of what I really wanted to keep in mind. I was super open to trying out different things and if something piqued my interest, I was like, you know what, I'm down to try it on, let's do it. And so I did try on a couple of fun ones and ultimately I went back to the original dress that I had been eyeing since before the appointment. You, you really do just know when you put it on and when they put on the veil on me, that's when I got really, really real. I just got my lashes refilled yesterday so I was not allowing any tears to happen. But yeah, we are moving along really quickly with our wedding planning. We have our major vendors, we have our date, our venue, our caterers, our photographer, videographer, and our florists. And I am just so excited. I'm focusing on a lot of like wedding stuff in this vlog and the next video is actually going to be um, more home stuff and another vlog as well instead of my usual luxury fashion sit downs, but I do have some house updates for the next video. So that is what I've been working on as well in terms of like taking a break off of filming last week. So I've just like been cleaning and organizing. I got the itch. I'll talk about that in the next video. We're in like wedding stuff right now, but yeah, we have our major vendors. I have my dress and I have to be careful that Marco doesn't see it. There were so many different styles and I think a lot of it has to do with venue as well and so I was thinking about our venue a lot when it came to the dress. I was trying on dresses that were like, oh this would be perfect for a beach wedding or oh this would be perfect for like a New York City wedding. That's what was kind of going on in my head. Today I'm just catching up on some work. Tomorrow Mark and I have a wedding that we're actually attending so maybe I'll show you guys what Mark and I are wearing as wedding guests. I think that would be just make sense to throw in. Um, and then my sister's watching Wade, so there's that. Um, yeah, that's all I got for now. I'm gonna heat up my Taco Bell that's in the fridge and finish the coffee that I've been working on since uh, earlier today. I really should be easing off my coffee because of like anxiety and stuff. I should switch to matcha for a few days, but. Hmm. Okay, battery's dying, so. I'm gonna do some work and I'll see you guys later. This is my outfit for the wedding. This is a Reformation dress. Um, pretty 
covered up except for obviously the plunge. I wore my Hermes belt using the mini saddle. And inside I have a credit card, my ID, uh, lipstick, gum, fashion tape because you never know, and lip gloss. I think that's all I need and I'm just gonna spritz some perfume and Okay guys, so it is now Sunday night. Mark and I just got home, we got groomed. Uh, I, again, this place is a mess. So there's gonna be a lot of home updates and cleaning in the next video. So there's gonna be another vlog, but I'm going to wrap up the vlog here because I do wanna start editing this, but hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing me dress shop and then a little bit of our wedding guest outfit. Um, I will have links to everything down below. Once again, thank you so much for joining and I will see you in the next video. Bye.